Ready? Ready? Yeah, go. Okay. Um, problem with the lights. We've got this one. It's not the um, main beam. Uh, it's the dip light, the top one, not working. If you look on the other side, it's working. That one. Oh, sorry, wrong end. This one. We've got to change it. Now, we thought we could do it for getting a hand behind, as, as it was mentioned in the Haynes manual. But um, although we can move the clip down, there's a clip here behind. Um, anyway, we, we dropped the clip, but we still can't get to it with our hands. And the only way we can see is to remove the light again. So that means I'm clicking it here. And then there's a bolt down here, which we've removed. And then the next bolt, to get to it, we've got to remove the indicator because you won't get to it otherwise and then you can get to it under there you undo that one and then you can remove then you can take the light out yeah so okay, okay. pull it off obviously you've um, took the indicator out undid the three bolts and you got it out yeah you undo this clip so you got which takes the cover off stops the water getting in and then you gotta unplug this and then bend this back somehow or bend it forward oh hang on underneath and then lift it and then you can take the bulb out and replace it. Game, game. Yeah, so you you uh, place the bulb in, key at the top, so it sits it's in there nice and flat. Put the clip back on, which is as easy as that. And then you've got to reconnect the cable, which is as easy as putting this back the right way like that, press on, and then you put the plastic cover back on, okay, yep. plastic cover back on, uh, like so, and put the clip on, then you've got to re-plug this in, um, probably get that on once you've got this in position, it goes back in there, you get the click, and then you test it to make sure the bulb is working. The thing is to test it <laughs> to make sure you haven't wasted your time. And now there's no light back on. So we're all working. Just put bolts back in and uh, you might have to replace a couple of clips where the, uh, for the bumper. The replacement clips, so that, that's the problem. But unfortunately, there was no other way of um, replacing the lamp without uh, taking the bolt to uh, taking the lamp out so um, there's no other way again it's, it's a bit more it's more involved than we imagined uh, however the job's done everything's fine Check indicators, check lights, all working. <laughs>